Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, well we have a new version of Firefox. Firefox 109 is now released so if you go to your Firefox web browser upper right hamburger menu and go down to help and about Firefox you will actually be pushed to version 109.0 latest version of Firefox web browser, the only browser that is not um, dependent or not created around the Chromium engine. What's new in Firefox 109? Uh, the biggest change is now the introduction of the Manifest V3 version 3. What's that? Well, it's simply a new way of actually treating and signing extensions and what you can do and also having extensions work better in uh, your privacy settings. So preventing some of the requests to keep you even more in a privacy environment. Uh, Manifest V3 is not something welcomed by everybody, including Google, but uh, Microsoft, uh, Firefox, sorry, Mozilla is pushing ahead with its Manifest V3. And uh, that is what's going to happen in 2023. They're going to examine the manifest uh, V3, see how well it is actually working. And, well, if it's uh, worth, they're going to keep some of the functionalities of the V2, which is still ex uh, actually available in Firefox. Now, there's also a under-the-hood security uh, feature that is the arbitrary go code guard exploit protection. This enables anything that you play back that is media, that's audio or video. You know, that and that happens. I've seen it in the past where video, malformed video or audio can actually create an environment where malware is actually distributed. Well, you'll have the arbitrary code guard that will now actually uh, be enabled in the media playback utility processes so that that's going to improve security. Um, for all the uh, different um, the platforms, including Windows. There's uh, a now a native HTML date picker for date time inputs. Now you can use a keyboard. So if you actually use keyboard, you can also use uh, the uh, keyboard shortcuts. And that could help if uh, you're in some way disabled and maybe you use the keyboard to actually navigate through different options. I'm uh, going to make it easier. And finally, if you are in Argentina and Spain, there's uh, now a local um, built-in dictionary in the Firefox spell checker. And that's pretty much it. Of course, there are security updates. And this is also important to update for that reason because security is everything, especially in a web browser, keeping everything up to date. So Firefox has security updates and if you are um, using Firefox well if you don't really care about the new features at least update for the security reason to stay safe as this is much more important than your antivirus and security keeping all the software up to date if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching my videos